Hey, what's going on, guys? Uh, this is ACD Wonder 95 here, and for you today, I have a quick tour of the 2012 Chevy Malibu LT variant. This will be a quick review and done in one take due to the lack of editing skills I have. So let's go ahead and start it up and unlock it. Check it out. Oops. The driver's side seat is power adjustable with power lumbar with manual recline. Two, uh, two stage heated, heated seats for the driver and passenger. For the LT variant, there is no keyless ignition. Nice plush leather steering wheel with heavy side bolster. It has a uh, rev limiter at about 3200 RPM. Power everything. Power locks. Cruise control on the steering wheel. Voice command for the OnStar. This car is equipped with manual with the uh, shifters on the side. single zone climate control the uh, fake plastic wood stretches all around the driver and passenger side of the car soft hard which isn't a big deal all the seats have leather side bolstering and a plush cloth and of course the driver and passenger side has um, heated seats okay so let's go ahead and do a quick tour of the vehicle first let's pop the trunk or the hood I can get this open. The Chevy Malibu is the Chevy Malibu LT is powered by a 2.4 liter EcoTech engine. There is a six cylinder uh, option available, but this one is powered by a straight four cylinder engine. Guess the job done. Decent amount of trunk space here. And now that the car has had some time to warm up, let's go ahead and rev it up a little bit. 
All right, we got to about 4,000 RPM. All right, let's go ahead and check out the rest of the vehicle. Before that, as you can see here, we have the OnStar and the uh, direction of where we are right now. Sorry about the bloopers, guys. As you know, this is happening in one take. The trunk release button is located right here. The driver's side seat is adjusted to my liking and it is kind of far back. I'm about five feet ten, five foot ten, sorry. And um legroom is adequate. It's very good actually for a mid size sedan. Have the uh 120 volt power adapter, which is very good for the long car rides. Two cup holders. Hard plastic. There are no heated seats back here, but you can't expect to have heated seats. Very nice looking console, in my opinion. There is no pass-through here, which may or may not be a complaint. As I had stated, we have the two-stage heated seats in the car, passenger side. One complaint I have about the passenger side seating is that the seat is a bit too low. That's just me. Okay, so before we head on out, let's take it for a quick little drive, all done in one take. So, pardon the, um, you know, the interruptions and stuff. Let's go ahead and adjust the seat a little bit. My lumbar isn't adequate right now. Alright. The uh, doors automatically lock upon the Putting the car into reverse, and it's kind of hard to drive with one hand. Brakes are very nice in this car.
Well, this almost concludes our video. If you enjoyed the video, go ahead and leave a like rating. That means a lot to me. Uh, I do these videos for fun, and the money is an added, you know, incentive. So, um, go ahead and like this video, and I will see you later. Bye.